What's up, YouTube? Back in the dungeon, about to get started on these seat bottoms. Got the top sitting over here in the cut. Got one sitting in the car. But uh, that's what I've been doing all day. Most of the day, cutting out patterns and getting them sold onto the foam and all that good stuff. Um, let's see, I'm about to get started on now. Let's see how these come out. And I'll check back with y'all in a little bit. All right, y'all, halfway through one of the bottoms. Got this section done already. Working on this front section. As you can see right here, that's the little guide foot right here. The guide just, you know, follows along the same here. And that helps you get them straight stitches all the way back as you can see keep everything nice and straight and consistent all the way across the piece so that's what I'm working on right there Here we go. Just finished wrapping that piece up. See how good that look. Now it's time to work on the side pieces to go here and here. And you know, I gotta get that seam to curve out and curve back in to meet up with this stitch, with this seam. Keep it all looking good like I, uh, like I had it on the tops. Like this right here, curve around and match up with that uh, front seam that's going across the seat. So that's what I'm about to work on now. What up, YouTube? I'm down here in the dungeon trying to get these seats finished up. As you can see, I got three more to go so on the bottom. I got this one done. A couple more pieces here to go on those, but uh. I'm gonna try to get this stuff finished up today. That's one less thing I got to worry about. Went to the junkyard and uh, picked up a few little parts that I needed. I needed some more seat foam. So I went and picked these up, only had two. I needed two more since I'm doing the four buckets as y'all know from the other videos. So I went and picked these things up. The uh, Malibu G6. All those cars come with the uh, Heated seats already installed, so that saved me a few bucks on buying those uh, heated seat kits that I was going to get off eBay, and uh, I just used the factory stuff. The seat frames already come with all the uh, electronics that you need to run it, you know, just, just pretty much run power to that. Uh, Plug both pieces in back here and you know run it to the uh, switch. But you got a low and a high setting. So I took these off of the uh, the seat that I got these pieces from. You know, I'm gonna run like a little console or something like that and house that uh those harnesses in there. But yeah, that's what I'm working on. Got both harnesses, one for each seat. I also picked up these little seat belt little return clips to hold you know the seat belt off to the side since I am doing the four buckets I did grab some um uh, I did grab some seat belt uh whatever you want to call this thing seat belt retainer some whatever but uh I'm putting new webbing in here I'm going with blue and these will be mounted you know up top doing the shoulder belts so I grab one from each side of that car. These are for the backs of the uh, two rear seats. These are the back pieces. I just snatched those off the seats. Got all that stuff. So uh, start putting it together. Try to get these other bottoms made up. Slap it on the phone. And uh, that'll probably be all I do today. 
probably get the uh, the heated seat elements glued onto the backs of the phone. But just to give y'all a little update of what I'm working on, I'm trying to put these seats together. Y'all stay tuned. Got more videos to come. About to put this old uh, sewing machine to work. I'll keep y'all updated.